A day in the life of an Atlantean citizen. Banking. Another daily business, besides participating in the decision-making processes of all groups to which your expertise could allow you entrance, is participating in the economy. Just as today bank buildings offer the service of withdrawing and depositing money, presently we use bills of credit, but the whole concept of money is wampum, a symbol for value that has no intrinsic value qualities about itself. So too in Atlantis, where instead of paper cash, gold coins, or even oil commodities, they have substituted ZPE the fifth element force of tachyons. However, in Atlantis, when you deposit their currency, you are diminishing the free market total of an energy commodity, and when you withdraw from them, you are increasing it. Thus, to limit universal entropy, lending rates can be leveraged to decrease withdrawals and the liquidity of their form of capital. Likewise, to increase universal entropy, lending rates can be decreased to encourage stimulus spending, thus generating excess energy entering the continuum of currency. Banking is, however, only one way of spending one's money, or in this case the esoteric energy of time itself, in any free market economy. It is not even requisite one has an account with any bank in a free society. A society based on free energy should be nothing if not an advocate for individual liberties, rights, and sovereignty. Ideally, the church bank system of Lemuria would not even exist. The purpose of banks is to rob the free market of liquid capital. However, in any system where spending is monitored, Banks will exist as moral accountants.